or bluey gray? Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Welcome to Goose. So, Sylvia and I made a crazy decision last night. What was our decision? We're gonna have a guardian, a livestock oh, yeah. guardian goose. Like, she's gonna be our livestock guardian goose. But look at her eyes. Somebody was like, she's so big now. And I'm like, she's so little. Like, I've seen geese grow so much faster. And then I found a video of her, <laughs> like the day she had, she was tiny. Hey, baby. She still is my favorite animal. See, she's so small in yeah. that. She's smaller than your hand. I know, and now she's like as big as Sophie's torso almost. <laughs> Help grab so, grab <laughs> yeah, that's my hair. So we only have one regret regarding the goose that we hatched. What's the regret? That we got a duck. Right, so we went to the sales barn. Oh, really I said, let's get another goose. They had perfect geese the same age as her. I said, let's get one. And what did you say? I wanted a duck. I want a duck. I want a duck. And now what happened? Hi, baby. Was mama right or was mama right? Yes. We wish we had two gar livestock guardian <laughs> geese because she is, geese are like babies. Whenever I talk, she freaks out. She's just talking back to you and eating your hair. No. All right, let me go get the duck. It's so breezy and it's not hot, but it's humid. It's the weirdest okay, feeling. When we go to Costco, we're stopping at the pet store and I'm getting fish. She wants to get minnows to the geese, to the goose no, and the duck. I saw someone on TikTok, he finds minnows and feeds them to the ducks. And I feel like they all love it. I feel like they're too young. No. Would you really kill a fish just to feed a duck? We gave fish to our chickens before. Yeah. Shh. Don't ask them. All right, so here is their new area for this morning. So the food that we feed the duck and the goose is special. It's food that we fortify with certain vitamins and minerals because Otherwise, geese will grow really quickly and it will put too much strain on all their joints and it can cause deformities. So we fortify it with a lot of different vitamins and we add stuff to it. Um, but the best thing for them is to eat grass. They still need the vitamins in the food that we give them. <laughs> but we also want them to eat grass because grass and the vitamins will slow down that rate of growth and help them not grow so fast. But yeah, she like almost seems like she grew overnight. I know, we, uh, we're obsessed. Like, I, I like the duck, he's, she's really cute, or he, whatever, probably a boy. Whenever you buy something from the sales barn, it's always a boy. But, Hi, baby. And the people always pretend like they don't know what it is, but it's always a boy. We like him and he's cute, but he's scared. And he's skittish and he's like not friendly like her. You know what I wish we would have done? What? Listen to mom? No, hatch two goose eggs. Yeah, we should have brought home two Stop goose eggs. At me. Is she hissing? She hisses. I wanna see her hiss. Do you guys think when she grows up and gets hormones that she'll like yeah. even be mean with us? Because geese can be mean. That's okay, why they make such good guardians. Because they'll alert you and they'll she chase off predators. She's like, I'm the duck is like, oh, thank goodness, and she's wagging her butt. She's got a little fluffy butt. She tries to fly. <laughs> the duck is like, should I trust it? Should I get some water? Oh, they're really cute. Oh, so far they're not messy. Like, they're not super messy and they're not super dirty. But I know as they get older, they will be. Our plan was give them to your brother? Yeah, our plan was to give them back to my brother, but I don't know if we're gonna do that, if it gets to a point where we can't handle them. <laughs> She's like, no, don't do that. Um, then we would, because they have, a, they have more geese there. And they have a bunch of ducks. And they have ducks, and so we would give them back. But, I mean, if it works out, and we just love her so much, and she settles in, and they just are like easy for us to manage, especially in winter, which they should be. Because we have plans to make it a little bit more easy. Um, if we do have to give them to your brother, I'm staying there. For <laughs> yeah, if we have to give them to the to my brother, if we give them back to my brother, then Sophie's staying. <laughs> but they're so cute. See, the the duck is so timid; it doesn't do anything without the goose. See, 
He's like, oh, she's like, I want to swim. See if we got <laughs> fish and put some fish in there. I don't think that they would eat them. But what do you guys think about putting a couple of goldfish in your in your horse tank? I've seen it so many times recently because it lives off the algae and cleans up all the algae. Uh, I've read like you can only have one or two in a certain size tank because otherwise it'll get too much ammonia in there and then it's bad for the horses and bad for the fish and all that stuff. So obviously it would need like some care. But what do you guys think about it? Ellie had a bath today. It's been a long time coming. I really don't like Even you Sam's waiting, been yeah. complaining saying, oh my gosh, your dog is dirty. It feels so good to see a clean puppy again. Oh my gosh. She needed a bath for like three days. So bad, but I just didn't have time. Every day we come out to get the horses, Honey puts on this big, huge show. She like runs from Sophie, waits till all the other horses are caught, and then after the other horses are caught, she does this big, huge show. But look at my baby. She is absolutely enjoying all the grass. After she puts on her show and she runs all over the place, she will run up to Sophie and stick her head in the halter. So she knows what she needs to do. She's loving her life. She's living her life. She's so far from all the other horses. Gracie's running. <laughs> but they pretty much all run up to us now. Storm and Gracie are best friends now. They're always together. Honey either stays with them or she'll like go off on her own. They're all coming in, but I wanted to update you guys on something. Here comes my girl. Oh, here comes honey. <laughs> oh my goodness. She waits for all of them to come. No, I got it. You missed half of it. And then they just stand up here and wait. She's, I see like some of her dark hair coming through, honey, especially like over here on her neck. You can kind of see it. Pom -pom. She's like chunky, but then she yeah she's she needs in. to get chunkier here yeah. instead. Of she's here. getting really nicely muscled and she's filling okay. in really Look at well. That belly. Yeah, she's got a bit of a Her belly. Hands. She likes running. To Come us. here, Penny. She's like, huh? I had a drink, so now I'll have a little snack. Okay. <laughs> I wanted to show you how trained my horse is. Come on. She just come up here without me. <laughs> Hi. That was self-loading. <laughs> so I, I've tried self-loading her before. Okay, now watch this. Back up. Back up. I'm gonna try and self-load her. Get back up. When we came on, I came on one side and she came on one side. Alright, hold on. Come on. Come on. Over here, you gotta come up this side. Come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Did she just, come on. You can do it. Did she just self load? My horse just self loaded. I had so much trouble with this horse, so much. I mean, I could have trouble again. I don't like to think she likes to travel. My horse just self loaded. What, you wanna be there to catch my horse self load? Sure. Uh oh, <laughs> I forgot that she doesn't know the rules. She has to stop. Okay, watch my horse. Back up. My horse just self-loaded, Gabby. Hey, did you bring your dog because I'm staying in the car? Yeah. Okay, so look. That's not self-loading. She did. That is self-loading. Oh, like girl. Honey. You like bananas? I'll get you bananas. Wait. Okay, was it self-loading? No. That's self-loading. Okay, so they uh, they, she did. I went on the other. Okay, comment below. Was that a version of self floating? Anyway, watch. Come on. Come on. So typically, oh, over here. She wants to go on that side. But typically, no matter where she's standing on this ramp, I can get her to come in. Come on. She's not behaving now. Sophie wants to self load the baby. Good girl, and then she stops. Such a good pony. Oh, stop. She actually turns around in here. Give me her. 
Okay. She doesn't like backing off the trailer. It's too scary for her. You have to work on it then. Because my horse like, hated oh, I found food. My horse hated backing off the trailer and now she backs on and off a million times. Well no, because the ramp is like steeper for honey. Yeah, so like the ramp I think is like Come on. The ramp is the thing that bothers her. Ellie's like, Ellie, get away from the dog the horse. She just slid at the end. Hi, baby. Hi. I missed her. She hasn't been out with me a lot. Ugh. She gets feisty when she's running. She gets feisty when she's running, but she's doing good. Good girl. No energy. So and now I'm walking her. She's like trot, trot, yeah. trot. She's loving she the grass. Everywhere. She's loving the sugar. Taught me a lot. If I had to like start my family again, I would not do a lot of sugar. Anyway. What I wanted to show you guys was how Penny will like, it doesn't matter. She it drove down with your purse there. I know. I set my purse in the truck and Sam drove down with it on there. Did you see my purse in the truck? She so the thing that I was trying to show you with Penny was that it doesn't matter where she stands on the ramp. Like she can stand halfway on the ramp. She can be standing off the side of the ramp. And I can say, come on. And then she just walks on. Like she is like, she is a contortionist. She can flip her body any which direction just to walk on the, on the trailer. In the, in the past, I've always had to like make sure she goes on straight so that she will go on. And it's been that ramp has always been like the big issue for her. But we did so much like walking on, walking off, walking on, walking off that she got so used to it. Like she's super comfortable with that ramp. So hopefully, cause we're going like, I think in a week is our first trail ride, like our real trail ride, which is always like the most, nerve-wracking one. Okay, so we're at Costco and it is sample day. Ellie would love that. Yeah, our dogs would love that. Oh, that's what you wanted. That's what you wanted to buy. Sophie wanted to buy this. They're on special. They're on special? How much? $7.99. $7.99? Are they good? Sophie are obsessed with books. You look on that side. Oh, whoops. You look on that side, I'll look over here. We got water for our barn fridge. Toilet paper. So uh, we just got done shopping. I'll show you what we got. But, I get to go to the but now. it's pouring rain. <laughs> we had to walk back in the rain. It is scorching. Whew. Anyway, we were gonna ride today. I don't know if it's raining at our house, but if it's, it's not. The storm needs a break. Yeah, so we might just work with our ponies today. So you guys know how Daisy, Dalmatians can't have a lot of foods. They can't have, there's like a lot of food things that they can't have. Well, we always buy a food at Costco because it's safe for her. It's the only one we've ever been able to find. And now they don't sell it anymore. So I'm having to try and figure out what we can feed her. Basically, they can't have a lot of meat. And they can't have peas. Sophie and I have come across literally three snakes in the last couple of days. It's been wild. Like a huge one this morning. It was huge. You didn't even get to see it. It was so big. She took a picture of it. It's just way too hot to ride. So it's unfortunate that we didn't ride today. But the horses are probably glad because it's really hot. It's really it's humid. Night. So we're having some duck and goose time. Should have brought my phone and took pictures of them. So if we got a couple of minnows, I know it's not everybody's favorite thing. She got some, so we got some feeder fish to feed to the duck and the goose to teach them how to hunt for fish. Gus, Gus. So look away if you don't want to see ducks hunting for fish. Okay, how do I... Okay, well there's the dead one. We've done that before with the chickens and not a lot of people like it. <laughs> Can I get them all? Yep, they're in there. Gus, Gus. All right, we are gonna see if baby goose like fish. <laughs> Look. <laughs> no, not the food. <laughs> this like, I'll food. just have grass, thank you. Look, I don't wanna. Like... I feel like the duck would be better. She almost ate it. She realized they're there. Oh. Oh, what's that? She says. Look at how slow they're being. That's sad. Don't look if you guys are going to meet. Don't look if this is upsetting to you. Look. Grab her. Look. 
This one's already dead, so eat this one. All right, I think, I think, oh! Oh! Oops. Oh, he smashed its head open. I think they're too young. Don't you know that you're beautiful?